Hi Saggy, welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be doing your general love reading. Okay, um, <clears throat> just know that these readings are general, okay y'all? So if this does not resonate with you, you know, let it fly. But you can also look at your Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs, okay? Maybe those will resonate with your story more well, okay? And yeah, y'all, um, if you'd like to book a personal reading with me, I'm only accepting PayPal for now, okay, y'all? There's something going on in my cash app, so if you want to book a personal reading with me, you could PayPal me at jlovestarot at gmail.com. That, all that information is in my description box down below, okay? So, yeah, we're going to get straight into your reading, all right? We're going to look and see a person... How they feeling about you? How you feeling about them? Okay, what's the vibe and what's the energy here? Okay, so yeah, so let's see what's going on, my beautiful Sagis. Okay, this is gonna be the last week of April that we're going to be doing these videos, and then we're gonna go right into May. Okay, so I'm gonna show you guys. Okay. And we're going to look into your person, spirit. How does this person currently feel about my Sagittarius? How does this person currently feel about my Sagittarius spirit? Okay. Ooh, the Page of Cups. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces energy. I see new love or... Past love here. But I feel like somebody here has a lot of love for you here. Okay? Either somebody has a lot of love for you. This person has a lot of love for you, Sag. Or you could be dealing with, I mean, a new person is coming in for you. Okay? Queen of Pentacles. Wow. Taurus Virgo Capricorn. So I feel like this person loves the way that you are carrying yourself right now. Okay, this person is seeing you or they have a feeling or they already know who you are. And I feel like this person is very attracted to your beauty. They see that you're getting your money. They see you're financially stable. Okay, and they like that. They like that you are, you know, looking good and acting good, being so independent and working on yourself. It makes this person very attracted to you, Sag. Okay, the Four of Cups. Hmm. Okay, let's see what else we have. The Page of Wands, your energy here. The Four of Pentacles. This person is afraid that the energy isn't reciprocated, y'all. Okay? Like, this person has a lot of love for you here, but they're kind of scared that you don't love them. Like, this is the energy that I'm getting here. Okay, like they, this person is kind of like having some fears and they, they're kind of having this feeling that you are going to reject them or you don't feel the way that they feel for you. Okay, I feel like that this person has been thinking a lot about coming forward and wanting to have a conversation with you about something. Okay, there's something in particular this person wants to talk to you about. Okay, or this could be your energy with the Page of Wands. I feel like somebody here wants to talk to the other person, but they're kind of scared of what could happen. Okay, the Four of Pentacles. This person doesn't want to let this connection go here. Okay, they don't want to let you go. The Tower. Ooh. So this could be unexpected. Okay. Or this the Tower could also talk about, you know, destruction and conflict so I do feel like there was an a, a lot of conflict and a lot of toxic energy in this connection here and now it's like <clears throat> this person wants to come forward and they want to um move forward from this connection and compromise with you but they're scared they're having some fears and doubts yeah the two of cups this person wants to be with you um Sag. They think a lot, they think about how much they love you and how much they want to be in a relationship with you. But because of this 
um, tower moment that happened, they're scared of rejection. They're scared that you don't feel the way that they feel for you. And they're scared that if they was to come in, um, you would automatically cut them off or you, you would walk away from them. And they don't want this from you. Because this person is in love and they want to have a new beginning here and they want to reconcile with you. Yeah, the Six of Cups. This is a past person you're dealing with. All right? This person is thinking about you. They're missing you. Okay? So now we're going to look into your energy. All right, Spirit. How does, this, how does my Sagittarius feel about this person? How does my Sagittarius currently feel about this person, Spirit? <clears throat> how does my Sagittarius currently feel about this person? Okay. Ooh, the Eight of Swords in the reverse. Ooh, so I feel like you guys have been feeling stuck for a while but you want to unstuck yourself <laughs> okay meaning that you want to free yourself from having a lot of pain from this person hold on y'all i have to look up what the eight of swords means because i just want to make sure that what i'm saying is correct okay let me just see in the reverse yeah you want freedom from this situation you want to heal is what I'm feeling like, Sagittarius. You want to heal things with this person is what I'm feeling like. Okay? You want to get out of, you know, having a lot of hurt or holding a lot of grudges from this person. And find find a solution and work something out with this person here. Okay? Ooh. How does my Sagittarius feel about this person, Spirit? What's my Sagittarius' current energy towards this person? What do they want with this person? How does my Sagittarius feel about this person's spirit? The Page of Cups. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Energy. So I feel like you think about this person a lot, Sag. You think about this person highly. Okay? I feel like you la both of you guys have been thinking about each other with the Page of Cups. Okay, the page, both of you guys have the page of cups. Both of you guys are thinking about each other. Okay, you're fantasizing about them. You're dreaming about them. And I feel like you have so much love for this person. And I feel like that's the reason why you want to come out of this stuck energy and have something new here. You want to move forward towards any type of, you know, from any type of conflict that was going on. You want to move past it because you're realizing how much love you have for them. Spirit, how does my Sagittarius feel about this person? The Nine of Pentacles in the reverse. Ooh. Three of Wands. The Four of Wands. King of Cups. And the Page of Pentacles. Okay. So I feel like you guys... <clears throat> Okay, but yeah, this is a past person you guys are dealing with, I feel like. All right, so I do feel like you, you Sagittarius, y'all are thinking about this person a lot, okay? I feel like this you you constantly are reminded of them. You constantly can't stop thinking about this person because I feel like you do have a lot of love for them, okay? The Nine of Pentacles is in the reverse. I feel like you look at this person who was, you know, didn't really have... You know, they didn't have what you had in the in the past here, okay? I feel like this is a past person. And I feel like you've looked at this you looked at them as somebody who um something with their money here. Like I feel like you look like you feel like this person was working too hard about something. Or you feel like this person didn't have the success, didn't have the money that you had, okay? But now it's like you're seeing their worth, 
okay? Before, you didn't look at this person very highly, Sagittarius. This is what I'm feeling like. Before, you didn't really care about them. You wasn't really checking for this person. You wasn't really thinking about them. But now, the fact that, you know, this person, you know, both of you guys want to reconcile. Both, of, You know, you're having this feeling that you have a lot of love for them and you do care about this person a lot. You also want to reconcile with this person. Okay, the three of wands, you're waiting. All right, maybe you're waiting for this person to make the move. Maybe you want this person to make the first move, okay? Or I feel like the Three of Wands could also be about planning. So maybe you're planning to come forward or maybe you feel like this person is planning to come forward. Okay, the Four of Wands. You want something with this person, Sag. Okay, you want victory, you want success. You want to celebrate with this person. You want to be there with this person. Okay, the King of Cups and the Page of Pentacles. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Energy. Yeah, I feel like you think about this person a lot, Sag. This person is always in your on your mind. You can't stop thinking about how much you love them. Okay. You didn't think about you didn't think this way towards them once before with the nine of pentacles in the reverse. The eight of swords in the reverse. You want to reconcile with this person. You know, you want to move past any type of hurt, any type of conflict and come together with them because now you're you can't stop thinking about how much love you have for them. And with the page of pentacles, it could also represent apology. So maybe you want you want to apologize to this person about something. Okay, or this could talk about like a new beginning. So maybe you want a new beginning with them. Okay, so both of you guys are feeling almost the same way towards each other. Okay. So yeah, y'all, that's going to be the end of this reading. Okay, if it resonated with you, please give the video a fat thumbs up. Okay, comment down below because I'm very interested in hearing guys' thoughts and opinions on this. Um... If you'd like to book a personal reading with me, like I said, I'm only accepting PayPal. All right? And yeah, y'all. I hope you guys are doing well. And I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.